This video explains customer payment follow-up in Odoo 30. In our businesses, almost every sales and purchase are under credit mode. And it is highly essential to collect those payments without fail or any moment's delay. In normal case, it is hard to find customers whose payments are overdue and to follow up. Odoo helps to customer follow-up report. The function helps in identifying the payments that are late and in parallel allows the user to send the appropriate reminders. Here one can apply multiple methods to remain the customer for payment by the total dues. Let's see how we can follow up the customer. Go to accounting module. Here in configuration we can see follow up levels. First we have to create a follow up level. So we can see the action we have taken. Let's give first reminder email. Uh, when should this reminder should come? Uh, after overdue. I'm giving 10 days after overdue. So what are the actions we need to take? Here are the actions. Send an email. And then message, print a letter, send a letter. So I'm clicking send an email. And this is the first follow up action I'm creating here. We can set auto execute here and save it. So go to payment follow ups. We may have to give one more follow up action because if they won't give the payment in these 10 days we have to need one more action so i'm adding one more action second reminder call after 15 days so send an email and clicking it and clicking all this and we can set a manual action too i'm setting a manual action so who is responsible to make this action and giving initial admin what all the action type these are all the action type i'm giving call as an action we can set a note here for the customer likewise we save it so these are the follow-ups so I am going to create an invoice selecting a customer decodict with the payment terms and giving it a, a date A date of uh, November uh, October give one giving it and add a product. Post it and go to customer follow up reports. Here we can see the customer deco addict with overview invoices. Select it. This is the invoice we created, which is overview. So here we can set an action, send my email, send by SMS. Likewise, here we can set next reminder as a manual. And this is the message, email message. We are going to send we can edit here and send my email the mail will be gone to this customer this is how call up levels are done in photo 13 thank you for watching if you are interested in knowing more about this 
or looking for any odoo implementation or customization in your business drop your request to info@cybrosis.com